Annie with ByAnnie.com and Patterns by Annie, and I'd like to give you a little more information about our pattern in the mix. Let's talk a little bit about the supplies that you will need to make these sturdy mixer covers. The pattern recommends that you use three fabrics for each cover. A main fabric for the exterior, a lining fabric for the interior, and a coordinating fabric for the bindings, front pocket border, handle, and zipper pulls. The main and lining fabrics are quilted with soft and stable to give body, stability, and cushioning to the covers. Note that the pattern includes the option of quilting the fabric on a domestic machine or on a mid-arm or long arm. Cutting layouts are included for both options. Note too that you may be able to quilt less fabric than the full yardage requirements listed on the pattern if you quilt on a long arm machine. See the pattern for more details. Directional fabric will work for this project, though some adjustments may be needed. Please review the add-on video and the Using Directional Fabrics video for more information. Using by Annie's Soft and Stable for the covers gives great body and stability and enables you to use any type of fabric. We especially like to use quilting cottons because of the wide range of colors and designs that are available. You will need a one yard package of soft and stable for either the small or the medium cover and a two yard package for the large. You will have leftovers for another small project or two. We suggest trying the catch-all caddy or in control patterns. They're perfect for holding supplies in any room of the house. Zippers are attached to the front pocket and one side pocket. We recommend that you use handbag zippers from Biani.com. Their wider width makes installation easy, and you'll love their extra-large slides. One 30-inch double-slide zipper will make both zippers needed for each cover. The pattern includes complete instructions for using one zipper to create zippers for two pockets. A mesh pocket on one side of the cover is divided into sections and expands to hold machine accessories and more. By Annie's lightweight mesh is available in many fun colors and is packaged in a half yard package. The piece measures 18 inches by 54 inches. One package will make pockets for several covers or another project or two. Here's a tip. Cut small pieces of all the colors of mesh that you've collected. When you're ready to pick mesh for your project, lay out the pieces to audition colors. Sometimes the one you think is the obvious choice gets bumped by something completely different. The mesh pocket is bound using fold-over elastic, which stretches along with the mesh. It also adds a pop of color and is extra easy to attach. By Annie's fold-over elastic comes in many fun colors and is packaged in a two-yard package, which is enough to make pockets for several covers. You can coordinate the fold-over elastic with the mesh, or use a contrasting color to liven things up. We keep pieces of fold-over elastic on a ring to make it easy to audition colors. Finally, you'll also need some thread to match the fabrics. Stitching will be visible on the main fabric, the lining fabric, the coordinating fabric, and the fold-over elastic, so we suggest gathering threads to coordinate with all. We use and recommend Superior Threads So Fine Number 50, a 50 weight polyester thread. Once you've purchased the In The Mix pattern, be sure to visit Biani.com and use the unique coupon that came with your pattern to get the add-on video that we filmed for the project at no charge. This helpful video series will give you an overview of the project so that you can get off on the right foot. It will also cover the steps to measure your machine in order to choose the most appropriate size, including some tips for adjusting if needed. Attach the side strip to the cover front and bind the cover bottom. The In The Mix pattern is fun to make and offers a great opportunity to learn these skills. Quilt using soft and stable to add body and stability to your cover. Prepare a sturdy handle. Bind a variety of pockets, including a mesh pocket bound with fold-over elastic. Attach smooth, wrinkle-free bindings on straight and curved edges using cross-grain and bias binding. Easily attach zippers. Round corners to make assembly extra easy. And join pieces to make a beautiful, sturdy cover. 
We can't wait to see what you make, so be sure to share pictures of your finished projects with us. Find us on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and YouTube by using at Patterns by Annie. You may also email photos to us at marketing at If you liked this video, please give us some feedback by clicking on the like button below. Remember to hit the subscribe button too so you are sure to be notified when we post new videos. Thank you so much for watching. Happy stitching!